everyone, Kai here, and today I'm coming to you with another book review. And this time it is Sankofa by Chibundi Anuzo. So this book, it was happenstance how I picked it up. I was in Barnes and Nobles one day waiting for the bus, so just trying to kill time. And um, I was attracted to the beautiful cover and the name Sankofa because in college, we had a club named Sankofa for Black folk. And so I was interested. I read the flap and I was like, oh, okay. I kind of like the premise. Um, and so I'll share a little bit about the premise. Uh, it, this book follows a woman, a middle-aged woman named Anna, who is recently divorced to a man named Robert and she also has a 25 year old daughter named rose and anna was a housewife but before she got married she was a you know on the rise architect so she was really um she had like a super bright career in architecture ahead of her but she decided to put that all aside to raise her daughter now she's divorced she also just loses her mom. So there is a lot happening to her at once. And again, all of this is in the first two pages of the book. Uh, she, while looking through her mother's things after her mom dies, she discovers a diary. And what she learns is that the diary is that of her biological father. And this is, you know the missing piece to her now you have to understand I'll give you a little bit more about Anna Anna she is a mixed race woman um, so she never felt like she fit in anywhere uh, she was raised by a white mother and um, and a aunt and a grandfather and so she did deal with she does share you know the subtle racism that she had to deal with growing up um but now she finds this missing piece of her uh that she's been desperately searching for right and so this diary kind of opens up a new life a new opportunity for her um to discover more about who she is. And so that's where I'll leave it with the premise, but the book deals with so many themes. Obviously it deals with, um, you know, identity. It deals with grief. It deals with uh, loss, divorce. Um, it deals with, you know, finding yourself, um, finding, you know, another piece of you, your parent. Um, that you never knew. It deals with uh, family. Family is huge. Uh, different aspects of family. Um, it deals with just life after loss, right? And what do you do when you are in such a state where you feel like you're in your lowest of lows because you lost a parent or you lost a relationship? What do you do? Do you just crumble? Do you just stay and hide in your home or do you break free and and try to find new life right and try to find you know a way to push past all the pain that you're feeling and so we really go on a journey with Anna as she navigates those things and I enjoyed this book I really enjoyed the book I I felt like um it it is a little mundane in the beginning, which is fine. It's a lot of character development and build up, but then it takes a, a turn um, towards the middle and the end that is page turning. Um, and so you meet some new characters, more than what I've shared already. You get to meet just, yeah, it's so good, it's so good. Um, but it is, a, for me, not saying for anyone else for me it was a slow read it did take me time to get to the point where I'm like "Ooh, this is a page turner um but I really enjoyed it I really you know this was one of the reasons that I felt proud of myself once I finished and it's certainly something that I would read again 
But yeah, have you read this book? What were your thoughts? Are you interested in reading it? Let me know in the comments. All right, I'll talk to you later. Bye.